Good afternoon everyone, especially my dear honorable teachers, respected guardians, avid viewers and my lovely students. You are most welcome to Chattagram Online School. Uh, how are you today? Okay, the students at first you will make sure whether my class everything is okay or not. And the students in last class we have learned same passage one and now in today's class we are going to another exciting and interesting uh, passage interesting passage uh, and you'll find now okay so let's get it started are you ready I think you are ready so first look at the screen here what do you see here in the picture can you tell me the system that you see in the picture? Can you can you tell me what is this? Yeah, this is called solar system. And can you find our Earth where we live? Can you find? Yeah, perhaps this is the Earth, and all of these exist. The students we are talking. Actually, this is a whole. There is. Uh, this is a whole whole empty area uh, area all the planets are moving around this star the sun and every every planet has a specific particular uh, space orbit specific I will ask you another question do you know the man do you know the man in the picture the great man in the picture, big man, big person, is a Yuri Gagarin. Okay, we are talking, we are talking to this man and his, uh, uh, his entrance into, into space. The students, that means we are going to, uh, read. We are going to read unseen passages to. You will find Russia Hebrew. Question number uh, question twenty nineteen, and uh, you will find these uh, this text item number four and five. Four and five. Okay, read the passage on measure Yuri Gagarin and answer questions four and five. In question number four, you will find a table. Look here, you find a table and question number uh, four, table five number, uh, a summary you have to write on the basis of the text. So let's read out the first, I'd like to read out the passage and then you'll repeat after or follow and try to understand the all, every shade of the meaning of the sentence of this passage. Yeah, we are talking uh, to uh, Major Yuri Gagarin. Yuri Gagarin was a Russian pilot. Russian, it is his uh, Yuri Gagarin. The man is Yuri Gagarin. Uh, he was Russian. Russian means it is his nationality. Russian, he, he was born in Russia. You know, Russia, uh, it is the largest. You find uh, this is the map of Russia. Russia it is the largest country in the world. The students, so uh, he was uh, born uh, in Russia, and uh, you also know Russia is the largest country in the world. It is situated northern Asia and eastern Europe. He was a pilot, you know, pilot and astronaut. Pilot is a person who who operates the controls of uh, controls of aircraft, especially as a job and astronaut. Who is astronaut? Astronaut, you will find astronaut also a person, a uh, person who, whose job involves traveling and walking into a spacecraft. Okay, he was the first human, first man to journey. You will find journey. It is also a uh, uh, sometimes you will find journey is used as a noun and sometimes you'll find a, a verb verb here journey has been used here as a verb so he was the first human to journey means has first human to travel 
inter outer space here outer means the outside of something and space empty area it indicates the outer space of our earth he on his spacecraft a spacecraft is another types of vehicle it travels into uh, in, into space is named Vostok you uh, Vostok actually this is the yes, spacecraft Vostok okay the students please make sure uh, whether you can see uh, my uh, my screen and me and everything clear okay completed an orbit orbit you see here orbit is the compass around follow, uh, followed by a planet orbit of the earth on 12 April 1961 okay Yuri Gagrin was born in the village of Kloshina Russia you know Kloshina it is uh, a name of a village uh, Yuri Gagrin was born here Russia on March 9 1934 his parents father and mother worked on a farm um, he was the third of four children is very simple language so you can understand in 1946 Gagarin completed his secondary education at Kloshino secondary education at Kloshino uh, at the okay um, at the age of 16 in 1950 he entered you know he entered me joined a foundry steel factory here foundry means a, a kind of factory where glass or metal uh, is melted and, ga and given into uh, shapes or objects a steel factory near Moscow you know capital of Russia he did his graduation from a vocational school in 1951. A vocational, a vocational school means such types of school provides that the students is uh, a skill knowledge, and that you need to have a have a particular job. And in 1951, then he took a training as a Soviet air cadet at a local club where he learned to fly at first. Then he again graduated from a technical school. The students again another type of school. Technical school means that it will render you a, a practical, a practical use of machinery method, machinery method uh, to find a special job in 1955. And he was recruited in the Soviet Army. He became lieutenant in the Soviet Air Force, uh, lieutenant rank in 1957. In 1960, Yuri was selected for Soviet space program. Program on 12 April 1961, he became the first human to travel into space and moved around the Earth. He died in 1968 in a plane crash in a plane accident okay the students now we are going to learn some important vocabulary that we have found found here a uh, new look here uh, uh, astronaut astronaut here a person whose job I've said earlier involves traveling and working in a spacecraft and a spacecraft means a vehicle that travels in a space Orbit a curve foot followed by a planet or uh, an object is and it moves around another planet, star, moon, etc. Recruit here yeah, recruit means to find new people to join a company and organization as uh, the armed forces etc etc. Lieutenant an officer of middle rank in the army, navy or uh, air force. The students now you in your exam uh, question pa uh, paper you'll find such kind of question you'll be given you'll be given such kind of table and in the table some information will be taken of and you have to transfer some information from the text to this missing place this is called information transfer so let's learn uh, this is this column uh, the headline of this column name of it 
events, your time, you have to mention your place, achievement. So born, that means when uh, Yuri Gagarin was born, then you have to mention here time, year or time you'll find in the text. Try think of the of the answer in Kloshino village, Russia. And next, uh, um, what happened here? What did he do in 1946 at Kloshino? in that village, took his bachelor degree uh, when, that's right here, the time from a vocational school. Then number four, uh, uh, 19, sorry, yeah, in 1961, what his uh, achievement, what have he gained here? And the last question, in 1968, what happened, what happened there? Actually, uh, at first, we are, um, uh, we are writing here this answer, March 9, 9 uh, 1934, and in the second, uh, second number, we will write, completed his secondary education, 3, 1951, and for completed an orbit of the earth, and number five died, that means, uh, that means he died here in 1968. Okay, you'll practice uh, at your home, write a summary of the above passage in your own uh, words, if it is possible, you write in the comment, later I'll check. The students, uh, actually this type of question won't be set for exam, essay exam, but for better understand, this is exercise for your skill development, reading skill development, so I have prepared some more questions to understand the text, to uh, make you clear the, uh, the topic. So the question is, choose the correct answer from the alternatives. Number one, Gagarin was born in China, Turkey, the Soviet Union, USA. Where, where was he born? China actually we have, uh, found uh, 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 he was born in the Soviet Union. Okay. Next, he was a famous sailor, you know, sailor, a person who was uh, uh, on a ship in the sea, uh, cosmonaut, cosmonaut is um, tried, and scientist in Navy, actually the answer should be cosmonaut, and C, Gagarin was the first man on the moon, second man on the moon, first man in the space, first man in the sun, where? As what would be the correct answer here? Yeah. First man in this piece is space. D. Gagarin went into space in when? 1951, 1961, 1969, 1968. Actually, it is 1961. The last multiple best question here is spacecraft, you know, orbited round, moved the Earth once, twice four times or thrice. Here the answer, only once. Okay. So now it is assessment for you. Please participate in this assessment and try to answer the question. Uh, read the passage again and write uh, whether the statements are true or false again to remember I repeat here that actually from unseen passage you passage you will not get such kind of question pattern true false or um, CQ but it is I have prepared for only that understand uh, the topic so read the passage again and write whether the statements are true or false Gagarin joined a metal factory, um, factory, a uh, factory uh, near New York. Try. He was recruited in the U.S. Army. He completed two orbits of the Earth. He was killed in a crash on 1968, and his parents work uh, in a factory. Try. The students, now I'm going to give the correct answer. Number A, Gagarin joined a metal factory. It is right, but not near in New York. He was born in Russia, so here it will be near, near Moscow. He was recruited on the U.S. Army. He recruited not U.S. Army, Soviet Army. 
he completed two orbits of the earth here, two or not uh, uh, orbit of the earth, one time, and he was killed in a car crash, um, yes, this is, uh, this is uh, true, and his parents work in a factory, you know, we have uh, read here in the text that his father and mother worked in a farm, on a farm, in a farm, okay. This truth, that means uh, there are four answer will be will be false out of five and only number D is true. So you can check your answer here. You will find all of the answer of this question. Okay, we are going to end this class. It is your homework, and you will just mention the number and the answer here. Uh, yeah, life is born. Uri, uh, this is also about Yuri Gagarin. Life is born, born in, and uh, the first human to journey into uh, uh, outer space. You write your name of events, your time, and place achievement. This is your homework. Okay, dear students, with this, with this unseen passage, we have completed two unseen passage. In this way, we will, we, I will take more classes on unseen passage, and this passage is uh, uh, very important for you coming exam, especially for SSC exam. It will be useful for all the uh, uh, both the class nine and ten. So the students always, always keep practicing, never stop is study. The students, if you watch this class, if you understand this class clearly, please, please share this class, share this class with your friends uh, so that uh, all of the students can be benefited from my class. So I hope, uh, I hope you will stay, stay home and stay safe. So that's all for today. Thank you very much.